the man to watch in imperious form and the leading marksman in the league can he add to his total today on EA TV hello and welcome to the Riverside here in Middlesbrough I'm Derek Ray and sitting alongside me ready to provide all the technical and tactical analysis is Stuart Robson and what we have for you is live action from the championship it's Middlesbrough and they take on Fulham thanks Derek well both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly pinning the opposition back playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible hopefully we get a really good game here And a change to the scoreline in the Huddersfield match. Here's Alex Scott with the news. Yep, it's a goal for Derby County. This... Will it be? And excellent goalkeeping. Well, it is good goalkeeping, but the finish wasn't really good enough, was it? And apologies to Alex for having to cut her off to confirm Derby have scored in that game. And they now hold a 1-0 lead. Useful looking ball, blocked it brilliantly, just can't get it past them. Can he find the net? Ball is loose. And a goal! 1-0, and what a fast start they've made to this game. Well, let's take another look, and I'm not sure what the keeper was thinking there. Just look at his position, he made it far too easy for him to score. So Borough restart the game. A wake-up call for their players, perhaps. Can they find a response? This is a message for away supporters. At full time, can you see where you are? And your coach will meet Marcus you. Marcus Tavernier. Thank you. Well, they've lost the ball. Well, there's been quite the focus on him coming into today's game. The rumours coming out of the camp, Stuart, are that this may be his last season, but he's considering hanging up his boots. Well, if it is true, he'll be a big miss to everybody. He's been such a great player for them, but I'm always pleased to see a player retire before their powers start to wane. At the moment, he's still having a big impact on this team. Shalabar couldn't keep it. Good looking ball, there could be a chance now. He must finish! Capable of so much better from that position. Right, from what I'm hearing, there's been a goal in the Hull City match. That means we join Alex for the details. It's a goal. Can he take advantage? And the keeper more than equal to the task. Borough trailing, but a chance for them to show us what they can do at the set piece. here no real and the keeper more than equal to it so the corner played into the box it might still be problematic well, we never like cutting off Alex but sometimes we have to do it for understandable reasons when things are happening to confirm Hull City did score in that match and the match is level at 1-1 well, tremendous block. Tete. And news of a goal in the Reading game. Over to Alex Scott. It's a goal for Reading. They're back level. It's 1-0 with 36 minutes played. Many thanks, Alex. Well, he's lost the ball. Good pressure. Can they make something of this? And still a chance. And relief as the keeper holds on. Well, he reacts so quickly, doesn't he? That's a great bit of work from him. Might really be able to trouble them here. And he didn't hesitate. Good thing too. Well, he's so quick off his line. That's great goalkeeping, you have to say. And one minute of stoppage time has been added on. Good looking cross. Well, no way through. 
The first half here comes to an end. The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Sliding in, winning the ball, and once more, they've kept it. And a creative look about this. And possibilities inside the box. Not really the ideal clearance. And a time for cool heads. Harry Wilson. Superb block on the back of the ball from the flank. And I'm hearing someone has scored in the Nottingham Forest game. Alex Scott, fill us in. It's the goal from Nottingham Forest. Opportunity. Well, just over the crossbar. Excellent effort. Substitution for They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Well, transfer news for Arsenal supporters. It appears they've got their man, Stuart. Well, at around £45 million, I think they've paid just the right sort of figure for him because on his day, he can be a top-class player. I just hope he proves me right. And the emphasis is on creativity. Opportunity! Well, he had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. Played over. Oh, real chance for him. Well, he attacked it so well and made good contact, but he just couldn't keep it down, could he? Thirty minutes left for play. Sporar. Well, they keep working away, looking for an opening. Well, I think a classic commentator's curse just then. Couldn't make the ideal pass. Well, there might well be scope for them to counter-attack here. Well, it looked like open road for them, but up a dead end. Well, this is the home of live football and more live action from the Championship coming your way on EA TV. It's Middlesbrough facing Queen's Park Rangers. Terrific block. Well, some pretty big news coming through from one of the other games. Let's hear about it from Alex Scott. Yeah, Birmingham awarded the penalty, and it was a strong hand. Surely! Well, the defender deserves a bit of credit, to be fair. Yeah, I think you have to give credit to the defending there. Just enough pressure to put him off at that vital moment. Substitution time it is. Another successful intervention, winning the ball back. Plenty of options. But nothing comes of it. Well, more championship action for you to look forward to on EA TV. It's Fulham facing Millwall. Well, as we approach full time, we have to say, playing away from home hasn't been a problem for them. Can they see it out? Stuart, your thoughts? Well, they need to hold on here. Not long left now, but you have to say they've defended really well up to this point, and I just can't see them conceding now. This will be a really good win if it stays like this. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Just made sure nothing came of that. I think most defenders would expect to be booked halting an attack in that fashion and yellow it is a booking yeah he was too impatient to win the ball and probably deserved a yellow card well he tried to get it to dip right at the end of its flight well it's great technique he strikes it so cleanly but it just doesn't come down in time five minutes remaining and one thing is certain no one is leaving because it's still close Chalabar, what's he got to do? This 
could be it. And it is. He's done it. Surely a case of game over. Well, let's take another look. And I'm not sure what the keeper was thinking there. Just look at his position. He made it far too easy for him to score. Well, a second goal for them here. Well, we are going to have a decent amount of stoppage time. Three minutes to be exact. He's in here. Well, unable to bend his run offside. And so the final whistle here. The visitors come out on top, Stuart. Absolutely, Derek. It was fairly comfortable in the end because they were tactically superior, had better individuals and were always a threat going forward. It was a really good performance and a good...